Hello, it is Jaeger here, just doing a walk and talk straight out of the camera. Hope everybody's enjoying their summer of camera announcements. There's official announcements, which I'm glad those have happened. We finally know what the A7 S3 is all about, but these leaks, to me, and it's not a bad thing, really, ultimately, but the so-called leaks are really kind of the announcements now. Like, Leaks are really just advertisements in disguise. Why do I say that? Well, the fact that the A7S3 externally can record 160 ISO, that tells me that these, these leaks were really keyed in and locked in. And congrats to Sony Alpha Rumors who just had the upgrade of all upgrade in their sources because they have not always been super reliable. Same with Canon Rumors, but Rumors are in the title. I'm not knocking them. I'm just saying we weren't too surprised with most of the official announcements because we already had the so-called leaks on all these cameras. The 8K coming to the R5, for example, wasn't too much of a shocker. The shocker was the cooling system wasn't fixed, but that's another story. <laughs> but it was not about that. I'm pretty fine with leaks. It's fun to speculate on new tech and gear coming up. That just kind of goes with the territory. Moving around, trying to get my light before sunset. Hopefully all these critters in the woods aren't too loud here. I'm also very entertained in the fact that if these leaks are becoming more official, are they officially putting out like bad photos? Like the people who have the cameras and are testing them and the people hired by Canon and Sony, is it like they left the room and someone came in with a flip phone out of 99 and took all these leaked photos? Cause they're really bad. The irony of leap camera photos being bad. <laughs> <laughs> now, I can't take away too much from any of these videos this summer. It's all basically been pre-production models of cameras, real-world reviews, or what I look at. I actually like channels like mine that might not have too many people, but it's real people using the cameras. So those not intentional real-world reviews are what I'm looking forward to come the end of September for the A7S 3 But as far as all the other YouTubers who have these cameras, the pre-production models, you can take a Jaeger shot, have your own drinking game of how many had the yellow labels on the bodies for the pre-production models. Keep an eye out for that if you go through a ton of videos of people who were talking about A7S 3 earlier here on the YouTubes. This is all I had to chat about. It's a quick chat. There's no big conflict here in this video. Nothing too clickbaity. I'm okay with the leaks sort of being advertisement is, is exposure like my shirt says available now jaegershots.com subscribe to never miss a shot from jaegershots.com bet we nailed it renegade where the hell my dog go <laughs>